How's it going, everyone? This is Shadow Tuner 1030, and today I thought I would bring you all another Jurassic Life content. And this time, I'm going to be showing you all gameplay of me and players taking down the new Apex raid boss. I know some of you are going to be wondering, Shadow Trainer, how am I able to participate in this raid a day early? That's because one of the players had the lobby and lives at the other parts of the world. So a big shout out to that person and also the ones who helped. Now before I go any further, I do want to quickly mention that Ludia recently started the Halloween sweepstakes. For those who are new and not familiar with it, players like you have a chance to be able to enter to win epic in-game prizes to celebrate Halloween with Jurassic Life. The sweepstakes will end on October 31st at 11.59 p.m. Eastern Time. Be sure to transfer the time zone. More details will be in the description below, so be sure to check it out if you want a chance to build a win some prizes. So with all that being said, let's go ahead and get back on topic of today's video. The strat that me and the players use to take down this raid boss is going to be right here. Feel free to pause this video, take a screenshot if you want to try this strat for yourself, along with the players. As for the raid itself, it's honestly very easy. I said it because the player who followed us on Discord, she did the raid before us and she can tell us exactly what I told you guys is actually very easy. If you and the player's creature stats are close to requirements for this strat here, it may or may not go very well. If you have the requirements that are exact or over it, you should have no problem. So the idea here is to be able to keep on uh, debuffing the raid boss and make sure you and the creatures end up surviving. Do you want to take down the raid boss on the second turn before getting to the next uh, round? Now the minions you're dealing with are level 30 Gala Mimas and level 30 Sucho Mimas. Which one deals with distracting, other one deals with bleeding. So you want to make sure that, like I said, you take out the minions in the first turn, and you, even though you could put in a healing creature if you want for other strats, but that's safe for another time. If you want me to make a video as to showcase you all as to all the strats that the players use to take down the raid boss, let me know because I really appreciate it. Now speaking of which, I do apologize for not showing an actual gameplay of me like on my phone here and showing my reaction to the raid here. Now, normally I would do that, but I was at work when I got this invite, and I was on break at the same time. So again, I do apologize, and I want to be able to make sure you guys get play and give you guys as to like the idea as to what we use to take this thing down. So this is going to be a pretty fun raid boss, and I don't think we players are going to be able to unlock this creature until maybe near the end of December or January, depending on our luck here. And I say it because there's, there's times you can be able to get like a 10 or a 15 or whatever else. But for me, sometimes I get very lucky getting like 25 or get 20s like that. But averagely, you get between a, like a 15 or a 20. I haven't seen a player get themselves a 10. If you guys have got yourself a 10 from the Apex Incubator from completing this raid here, let me know. I appreciate it. Now, even though they roughly got a 20 from this uh, incubate here, but I think it's a, a really good start here. Now, that's all the cover for today's video. The purpose of the video is letting you know as to how to take down this raid boss and give my thoughts on it. Now, let me know in the comments below that's ever covered here. Were you successful beating this raid boss? What strategy did you use to be able to take down this Apex raid boss? Let me know your thoughts. I'd like to hear it. Hopefully you all did enjoy today's video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give the video a thumbs up. Check the subscribe bell for more content videos. And as usual, see you all in the next video until next time. And don't forget to claim your in-game award for El Bartol Source, which will be in the community tab. So the uh, the link to that will be, uh, like I said, in my channel. You uh, scroll over to the community tab, like. And then you'll be able to, should be able to see the link to be able to get yourself El Bartosaurus DNA. <laughs>